My dear brothers and sisters, we are all parents, I'm like you. And the advice that I'd like to give to the parents, first of all, is that obviously our children are a trust which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given us. And therefore we are to nurture them and to raise them and help them to know right from wrong. And if we don't role model this, then our children will grow up with all sorts of problems mentally, religiously, uh, and some of them even physically. So they are responsibility which Allah is going to question us about. And the Prophet peace be upon him never abused or spoke badly to any of his children or any child whatsoever. Uh, he had a, a young boy who was 10 years old who wanted to serve the Prophet peace be upon him and he served him for 10 years. His name was Anas ibn Malik, was an orphan as well. His mother brought him to help the Prophet and uh, travel with him and so on. And this, uh, and he says, Wallahi, I never heard from the Prophet peace be upon him a single hurtful word from him, even the question of why didn't you do this? So if I, in other words, if I had missed out something that he has asked me to do and I didn't do it or I forgot or I became a little bit careless, he would never even ask me, why didn't you do that? But rather he would always be smiling or he would just remind me and that's about it. The Prophet peace be upon him never abused his any child. And in fact, he used to warn parents from doing so. In fact, he used to warn them from even harming them physically. And he says that uh, harming a child physically, verbally, or even mentally and emotionally is forbidden. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will ask us about it.